Brooks Brothers Factory in Queens values workers of all ages. Allison Morris is here, and she tells us that these folks are adorable. The plant is giving older workers the opportunity to stay working. It's awesome what's going on at this plant, guys. In fact, Columbia University gave them an Age Smart Employer Award because that's how good they are doing oh, good. at giving older workers a place, a great place to work. This is one of the coolest places I have ever visited in New York for a story. I had absolutely no idea that Brooks Brothers manufactured its ties right here in Queens. They also do alterations for 50 stores, much of the work done by hand. At an 80,000 square foot facility in Sunnyside, Queens, Brooks Brothers is turning silks into ties by the millions. Downstairs we have the tie factory uh, where we make uh, the vast majority of the ties that Brooks Brothers uh, sells in their stores. We make uh, a million and a half ties, so that means that every day we have to push out 5,500 ties. Um, you could have someone um, touching, uh, you know, 2,000, 3,000 ties a day. Luis Nava is the manager here in charge of ties, textiles, and a diverse population. ¿Qué tal, señora? ¿Cómo está? ¿Cómo está? ¿Le puedo enseñar aquí? Our experience is something that we value uh, greatly. It's not easy to find the talent um, to work in, uh, in a craft, in a skill like this. Um, so the people that we have, we want to retain. Um, and we really don't uh, make any distinction on age or gender, ethnicity. Um, we really give everyone an opportunity, and if you know how to, how to do this, we want to keep you here. More than half of his 219 workers are over 55, with decades of experience. We have uh, wonderful people working here, and a lot of them have been here for about 20, 30 years, even more. I myself am here 45. Every fabric handles differently, and you have to know, you have to work with the fabric in order to know how to handle it. What it should look like, and some the older people that have worked with that so many years, they know how to do it. 68 year old Paula Pasca has worked in alterations for over 20 years. Today, she's putting a custom lining in a made to measure suit. I do short cut, lower back, size, so open button, all anything they give it to me, I do. Well, for me, myself, and I think for everybody, this is like a house because we spend a lot of hours here and. Uh, it's a really good company. 74-year-old master tailor Mario Manorino came out of retirement to work here three days a week. His most recent masterpiece, a copy of the top coat Abraham Lincoln was wearing when he died. We had to make a replica of the Lincoln coat because when he was killed, he was wearing a Brooks and Brothers coat. So I had to go where it was the original, that it was all ripped. But there was a big part of it that was okay. So I had to copy every detail of the coat. I finished last year. This plant has made some other memorable pieces, like the tie Jennifer Aniston wore on the cover of GQ in 2009. Chances are, if it's Brooks and it's around your neck, it was born here.